they saw an imaginary, mythical, and possibly ridiculous monster, so just tell them they're wrong so we can leave, okay? Nikki, let's be fair. You're the expert in classifying all the plants and animals. <laughs> well, I do my best. So you'll know if we've discovered a new terrifying creature, or if it's just an ordinary animal. Proving that the boys are, in fact, dweeboids. What did this amazing beast look like? Well, it might have scales. Scales? Did somebody say scales? Let's classify the animals with scale. Here's a scaly operator of the genus Alligator, and his species is immense. Its name is Mississippi, and since his family is from Florida, their name is Alligatorida. They'll meet their cousins later, every caiman, croc, and gator, in the order Crocodilia, within the class Reptilia, with lizards, snakes, and turtles. Can this song get any sillier? If a gecko or a rattler, a chameleon or an adder didn't make it in my song, well, then it really doesn't matter. First the kingdom, you divide them, everything inside a phylum. Then to simplify the masses, they are classified in classes. Which are sorted handily, by order and by family. I mean, it's easy peasy, every genus needs a species. If it isn't in the song, well, then it really doesn't matter. Matter, 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 mat